Oh, look at that, guys. Hi, guys. How you all doing? Welcome to Backyard Chef. I'm Rick today. New kitchen, different location. And what we're going to do, we're going to make an absolutely fantastic fish dish, actually. We're going to actually cook some thin cod fillets in a lemon butter sauce. Now, it's a cheats lemon butter sauce. We're not going to make a big deal out of it. We're just going to melt some butter and chuck some lemon and pepper in. Simple as that. And pan fry the cod. So let's show you how to do it. Come on. Right guys, we're making a butter sauce. So what we want, we want a, a decent amount of butter, you know. What we're going to do is bob that in there. Get that in there. Right guys, we're using an induction cooker today, you know. So a different induction cooker to what we've been using everywhere but it's simple to operate really you know all you got to do is switch it on and then what you do with this induction cooker you actually hold where you want to cook from okay and then you just slide up slide up the dial and that sets the temperature on the cooker and all we're going to do is melt this butter down, we're going to make a brown butter. Now, very easy to do. Just melt it down and we, until we get that nutty type smell flavour. And then we take it off, chuck it in a bowl, add our lemon juice. And that is a quick lemon sauce. So just get that in there. Start melting it down. So, like I say, guys, all we're going to do is just going to stir this around till it starts to melt in this pan. Now, this is um, a simple recipe, you know, but we don't want to burn the butter, but we do want that brownness in the butter and give it that butter nutty flavour. Now, what happens is with butter, you know, butter has water and things in it, and obviously the water is going to evaporate out of the butter. And, and what will happen is the, the, the particles of the butter will sink to the bottom and it will start to go brown. So we have to be careful we don't burn it. Now you can actually add water to this and cook out the water until you get a brown butter. But we're going to try and do it all in one go. So we just have to be a bit careful. We might have to turn it down a little bit. We don't want to burn this, you know. And you can see it's starting to froth already. Now, that's all the fluids and all the bits in the butter cooking out. Okay? So we just have to be a bit careful we don't burn it. So we're getting that smell of the butter coming out of there already. But it's not nutty enough yet. And it's not brown. So we're going to try and cook this to brown. So nice and steady, just cook it down till we get a brownness in this butter. You know, on this induction cooking, it's probably going to take a little bit longer, obviously, than it will take on, on gas. But, you know, it will do the job. And this is a cheats butter sauce, actually, a cheats lemon butter sauce. Right, guys, if you can see in there, look, it's starting to go brown. Under those bubbles there, look, we have a brown butter. That is absolutely perfect. What we need to do now is take this off the heat. So we're going to take this off the heat and we're going to tip it into a bowl. You can see there all the brown sediment in the bottom. So we're going to tip that butter in there. Now we do not want to put all that brown sediment in there. Okay, if a little bit goes in that's fine. We're trying to have that brown butter but we don't all want all those particles in there so we'll leave those in the pan so we got that lovely brownness in there look now you could sieve that if you want but we're actually doing a a quick brown butter and that is really nutty so what we need to do is we need to go in with our lemon juice so what we're going to do we're going to go in with our lemon juice tip the lemon juice in give it a little stir around in fact, let's put this on the countertop, it's a bit warm that butter. And we want to go in with a little pinch of pepper. Get a pinch of pepper in there. And some salt. A little bit of salt. Give it a little stir up. 
so it's all mixed in. I know it sounds crazy, but we want to be tasting our butter. It's very nutty, not enough lemon. In with the lemon. Put some more lemon in there. It's got a fantastic caramel nutty flavour, but there's just not enough lemon. Still not enough lemon guys, so we're going to cut some more lemon and we're going to squeeze some more lemon in. So in we go with some lemon. So when I get some lemon in there, we don't have a lemon flavour. What we've got, we've got a really nice caramel nutty bit butter flavour. But we need a bit of uh, our lemon in because it's a lemon butter. So let's give that a taste test. Oh, a bit more. These lemons can't, can't be very lemony. So get that in there. We're going to do another one. They're only small, so I suppose if we're using a big lemon, we'd have enough. So give that a good squeeze in. So I'll just give that another stir up in there. And that should be a really nice lemon butter. Perfect. Actually not quite perfect. I think we want some more salt in. It's not salty enough. So let's put a little pinch of salt in there. Now give that a stir up. Give that a taste test. Perfect. Perfect guys. All we're going to do now is pan fry our cod. Right guys, what we've got, we've got some really thin cod fillets and they are really thin. Okay. What we're going to do is just pat them dry because we want to salt and pepper them. Then we're going to put some flour on. So just pat them dry. These are not going to take very long to cook in the pan at all actually. Okay, so we pat them dry as best we can. And then we're going to salt and pepper these and then douse them in flour. So what we're going to do is salt and pepper our fish. So turn it over, turn it over, put some more salt on this side, okay, and then we're going to pepper it. So put some pepper on your fish, do the other side. I'm going to take some flour, I'm just going to over the top nice and lightly and with my grubby hands from the uh, turning the fish over we'll just pat the flour on there. Now we don't want to be coating too much on, just a little bit just to help put a little bit of a crispy batter on there as it's actually cooking in the pan. Turn it over very easy this guys, very easy. Some more flour on there, bog standard plain flour, nothing hard about this. On there, pat it on, as easy as that. Okay. Right, what we're going to do to complement this butter sauce, we're actually going to cook with a little bit of butter and oil to fry this fish. Now we're not going to go too much with the butter, just a little bit in there, gives it that nice buttery flavour. And in with a little bit of oil, just enough to actually fry our fish. Now we're only going to shallow fry this, you know they're not very big, they're thin fillets. On with our flame, except we're using an induction cooker. And what we need to do is just get that melting in there a little bit, you know. Whiz that round in there. And we're just going to put that little, little bit of butter flavour in there with that oil. Right guys, 
usual way give it a shake off in there and then lay away from you so we got our cod in there look and then all we're going to do is give it a little bit of cooking brown it up on one side turn it over it's not going to take too long at all Okay, what you can see guys, you can actually see a little bit of browning around the outside. So this has started to crisp up a little bit. But this is very, very thin fish, so it could break up as soon as we turn it over. We try and turn it over very gingerly and carefully. Now these are skinless fillets, you know, I did take the skin off. So, could well break up. Impossible. Nearly. Nearly over in one go. Look, that's not too bad. Right, that's it guys, all we need to do is serve it up. So let's have this turned off. And let's get it on a plate. Oh, look at that, guys. Let's give that a taste test. Oh, look at that. Delicate, delicate cod flakes. Oh. Guys, superb. You know, that's got a really, really good lemon butter flavour through there. It's a nutty lemon butter flavour with that cod. It's superb. Serve it up with potatoes or peas. Fantastic light meal. Oh, guys, if you like what we're doing, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe, share with your friends, all that kind of stuff. Catch you in the next video. Mmm. Mmm. That is amazing. Oh.